I think that 211 gathers all of the important information in one place so that people who are in crisis or people who are experiencing a difficult time don't have to try to call multiple agencies to try to find the answer. 211 sort of sifts and sorts that information down and makes it easier for someone who's in a very difficult time to find the answers they need. 19 years ago, I became the custodial grandparent of twin granddaughters that have cerebral palsy. And as usually happens, we got them in the middle of the night. Um, the next day, we woke up to, we had braces and medicine and two pretty sick little children. And we had no idea what to do with anything. And uh, at that time, it was called First Call for Help. And, and what, what should we do? So we called First Call for Help, and they linked us with a cerebral palsy support group that was meeting that night. And literally that exchange, they also linked us with a number of other agencies that, that helped us along the way, but that link to that cerebral palsy support group where we met other parents and moms who had all of the same experiences got us connected to the people and the resources that we needed, and it really changed the course of what was to happen with us. We, it took so much pressure off us within one day having people we could call to help us. So it's an extraordinary resource from my, my opinion. And I always say, even if you think you're never going to use 211, if it can happen to me, it can happen to anybody. Anybody could need to use 211.